Hello everybody, and we're about to continue our Let's Play series of Visions of Mana. Let's see where our adventure is going to be taking us next. Okay, I think we are heading in this direction. Let's see what else we can find along the way. seeing anything down there really. I know we went down there earlier. So there's probably not much new in that area. And there we go. This was our victory. Okay, we do have some treasure over here. We can find it. Okay, there we go. Let me see. Is this? Okay, some ample incense. Yes. Okay, some lucre. Hey, nice. This hardly worth the energy. We've got another meridian over here to save it. Let's rest up. There is some treasure nearby as well, and some pots. Go. Taking this. Anything else on the shoreline? Not much going on over there. Welcome to the capital of the deep, Ilistana. Wow. The city looks like it's Capital of the Deep. Pretty awesome looking city, actually. So this is what the world's biggest city looks like. It may look grand now, but this city wasn't always as bustling as it is today. Its beginnings were quite humble. When the Aqua Orb began supplying the area with water, the people followed. Eventually, those people set off across the ocean and brought back trade and commerce. The people in their city ebb and flow like the water that gave them prosperity. It's always changing. Now that I'm back in Ilistana, I'm beginning to realize just how trapped I was in the past. I look forward to taking these first steps into the future with all of you. Ilistana, capital of the deep. Welcome to our fair city. Hey, we met you in Lekas, right? Do you know where we can meet up with the Alm of Water? A thousand apologies, but the Alm of Water has not yet been appointed. Oh, wow. I'm sensing a pattern in our adventure so far. Don't look at me. <laughs> Maybe we just walked fast and got ahead of schedule? I'm afraid that we, too would have expected the Alm from Elistana to have been chosen by now. In fact, our water supply has recently slowed to a trickle. If the fairy doesn't name an Alm soon, 
I fear the capital may fall upon hard times. Well, that's not good. However, now that the convoy of alms has arrived, we can begin preparations for the rites, regardless of the current status of our alm. The alms rites of initiation will be held this evening in the sanctorium. You've only just arrived in the capital, but hopefully that is not too sudden for your convoy. You are free to roam the city at your leisure, but if you wish for some respite, we have prepared rooms for our esteemed guests in the palace. There are many places within the city that are particularly popular with visitors. Uh, for instance, the market has valuable wares sourced from all corners of the world. Definitely have to check oh, that place out. From the Fountain Square at our city center is a most beautiful sight. It would be worth your time to take a turn in it. Please, Please enjoy, enjoy your, your stay. stay. Well, we've got the run of the town. Any suggestions, Morley? The official mentioned the fountain in the square, and that's certainly something you don't want to miss. I'd like to do a bit of shopping, if I can. <coughs> you too, Ramco? Well then, let's go our separate ways for now and meet up again later. Okay, sounds like a plan. Free until the evening, huh? So, the market or the fountain square? Morley did mention the square was pretty nice. Let's start there then. This place is really cool. Yes. Awesome views for sure. Oh, got some treasure over here. Okay, some more candy. Yes. Oh, treasures right behind here. Let me see. Nice. Okay, some chocolate. Shop is over that way. And here's our armor. Welcome. Please peruse what we have. Okay, these are a little better. Only the best. Thank you for your patronage. Only the best. Thank you for your patronage. There we go. Come again soon. Let's see what we have in the weapons department. Welcome. What will it be? Ooh. Okay, we don't need that right now. Ooh, those are better, actually. Blue Gale. Will that be all? Much appreciated. Oh, can't purchase that item yet. Will that be all? Much appreciated. Okay, I think we're looking good. Thank you for coming. Okay, there's some treasure this way. 
Let me see. This might be useful. Okay, 700 lucre. Awesome. Got some syrup. Grizzly. Yes. Okay, more lucre. Treasure this way. Let me see. Nice. Okay, fairy acorn. right over here as well. Yes. Gold clover. That's where that treasure is. Okay, we have a dud bear over here. I think we're looking okay for now. is impressive. Not that I have many others to compare it to. Can't get too carried away, or I'll get lost in the sea of people, though. <laughs> Let me see. This might be useful. Okay, another fairy acorn. <laughs> Taking this? Gold Clover. Grizzly syrup. Grizzly. Grizzly. Taking this. 120 lucre. Grizzly. Yes. Okay, where is that treasure? Oh, there it is. Let me see. Nice. Okay, 800 lucre. Awesome. Wow. Pretty cool. There is an item down there. We just missed it. Very impressive city, that's for sure. <laughs> uh. 
My apologies. <laughs> She's clearly in disguise. Sorry, I didn't mean to get in your way. Are you okay? Oh, oh no. Did you hurt yourself when you tripped? Looks like a sprained ankle. It'd be best if you rested for a bit. I'll stay with our new friend until they can walk. Feel free to explore Ilistana without me. This is your chance to see the capital. Alms are even allowed to enter the palace. Don't hold back on my account. Hope that guy at the fountain wasn't hurt too badly. At least Morley's going to stay with him just in case. Time to check out the palace. Who knows? Not, not so sure that was a guy, Val. I wonder if she's going to be joining our party at some point. Maybe she's like the queen or a princess. And she likes to wander around as a regular person. Oh, there are items over here. Taking this? Treasure must be on top somewhere. Yes. Over here, there we go. I saw a green light. There we go. Cup of wishes, awesome. Okay, a couple more items in this direction. Increases the chance to be burnt by 30%. That sounds awesome. Might have to use that at some point. Taking this? One more item. Hundred lucre, wow, that's a lot. Yes, definitely pays to explore. Is this what Pissar's key goes into? Sure, let's give it a try. 
Obtained Magic Smash. Ooh. What is Magic Smash? Critical hits will lower an enemy's magic attack. Does not apply to summoning magic. Oh, fun. Okay, there is some grizzly syrup over there. this jump? I don't think so. <laughs> well, there we go. We'll hop on the tree. Cookie. Got some syrup. to that other treasure. Yes. Okay, medical herb. stuck. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. time. See if we can find anything along the roof. It is a shame that the double jump feature does not work in villages.
Oh, I guess we're not going to be able to get that. Because I guess even if we did get on there, not sure we'd be able to do much beyond that point. Maybe we will just have to find that later. Can't do anything over here. Morley's talking to our stranger. This is how we get that treasure. Got some syrup. And there we go. That's where it was all this time. This is kind of exciting. This might be useful. Okay, some chocolate. Taking this? Do a quick sweep of the area in this direction as well. Yes. Get some gold clover. some treasure right over here. Let me see. A rare item. Some more ample incense. And now I think we're good. Commoners are not permitted to enter the palace. Now be on your way. But I'm the soul guard. I thought honored guests were allowed in the palace. Oh, we did not realize you were part of the convoy. Apologies for not receiving you properly, soul guard. However, we can't let anyone but the alms pass. All parties other than the alms themselves must have separate accommodations. 
We have reserved a room for the Soul Guard at the inn located in the market. I'm sure you may rest easy there when you need to retire. Oh, well, thanks anyway. It's urgent. Queen Palomina has slipped out of her room unattended again. Hey, can't you see her in the presence of the Soul Guard? Uh oh, sorry for the intrusion, sir. Wait, so the Queen just took off? Her Majesty's been sneaking out a lot lately. It's one thing when Master Passar isn't around to interfere, but we cannot keep this up. We promise to have her back safe and sound, and in time for the ceremony tonight. You know, sir, you may not be allowed inside the palace, but you can still go to the market. There are wares from all over the world available in our stores. It could be worth a look. Find some souvenirs, maybe. Souvenirs, huh? Come to think of it, Master Fugo liked to bring back trinkets from his pilgrimages. Hina's in the market now, too. It's not a bad idea. Thanks for the heads up! Souvenirs. Hey, rendezvous with Hina? Souvenirs. Wait, what am I thinking? Now's not the time for shopping. I've got soul guard duties. Our next move. We still have a little more time to try to see what's going to happen at the marketplace. Master Fugo used to bring back things like books from his travels. Hina would read them over and over until the cover fell off. <laughs> Those were the days. something you want? No, nothing I can't live without. An elm doesn't really need material possessions, after all. Maybe not, but I still... How was the palace? You just came from there, right? Oh, well, I tried. The guards wouldn't let me in, though. They said only alms are allowed. Oh, that's too bad. I did get to see the fountain, though. That was impressive. Let's stop by on our way to the Sanctorium. Thank you for your assistance. I think I'm fine for now. <laughs> Pardon my impertinence, but are you Queen Palomina? What? No, uh, I'm not. No disrespect, but your disguise is fooling no one. You? Uh, I concede that you are correct. I am indeed Palomina. I'm Morley. A swordsman by trade. Niccolo, a merchant here in Ilistana, took care of me since I was young. You must have a reason to be traveling through the city incognito. Uh, may I ask what was so pressing? Oh, but... Uh... I understand you don't want to burden a stranger with personal affairs, but it is no burden. I am the Alm of the Moon. You are? You can trust your secrets with me. I'm fated to end my journey at the Mana Tree. Who would I tell? The Goddess? <laughs> That's kind of funny. If you are indeed an Alm, perhaps I can trust you with this. Several days ago, the Fairy visited the capital and I was asked to accompany the convoy as the newly appointed Alm of Water. Oh, this must be a first for the royal family. How come no one has heard about this? Interesting. Everyone thinks the Alm hasn't been chosen yet. It is because I have purposefully concealed this information. If I were to abdicate in order to fulfill the duties of the Alms, the governance of Ilistana would fall to my younger brother Ian and Passar. Oh, Passar, that's not good. Oh, I see. Even I have heard the rumors of Passar's attempts to steal the throne. Hussar is precisely the reason I left the palace to seek guidance from Niccolo. I was, in fact, en route to his residence when we ran into each other. 
You know my father? Father? Yes, of course. Niccolo is my friend and faithful advisor. As a merchant, he is much traveled, with a vast network of connections. I have sought his counsel many times. Ilistana wow. may seem like a rich, well-regulated city. But it was not always so robust. The rulers of the past have been fickle in their governance. At times compassionate, at times cruel to their people. It had always been my intention to leave behind a sturdy civic foundation so that my successor might flourish in his role as ruler. Tell me, what would you expect from a monarch? You're asking me? I'm an Ohm. I have been chosen to offer up my soul. I don't think it matters what I want. I hope I did not offend you for asking a curious question. My ankle feels much better now. Thank you for your time and tolerance. You have been a great help. What will the future bring after we're gone? It's a great question. Mm. Are we stocked up and ready to leave for the mana tree after the rites of initiation? We shouldn't waste time. You're right. You know... We're already at the halfway point in our journey. I think it's about time to get back for the ceremony. Can we go to the pier before we make our way to the sanctorium? Sounds like a plan. You go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. Oh, that's kind of cool. I'll take this pendant, please. Thank you for your patronage. Looks like Val saw that Ina wanted friend? that. Maybe an engagement present? Am I on to something? Oh, come now. That's none of your business, you meddler. It's not our place, but if you two were thinking about your future, we wish you both the best of happiness. Hmm. I hope she likes it. Is probably at the pier already. Better get a move on. Hey there. <laughs> I was just starting to wonder if I needed to call a search party. Wow. It's lovely. Yeah. I love sunrises, but there's something about a sunset at the end of the day. I don't know. Sunsets feel a little like saying goodbye. Hina? I got you this. Oh! This is the pendant I... It, it's a present! You bought this for me, Val? I wanted to get you something, considering all we've been through. It's beautiful! I love it! Thank you! Oh, good! The sun might disappear at the end of the day, but as long as there's a tomorrow, it'll always come back over the horizon. I guess I do like that part of sunsets. We should make our way to the Sanctorium. An Ulm can't be late for the rites of initiation. Say thank you again, Val. I love the pendant. The smile on your face was worth every lucre. I just wanted to be the cause of it, is all. You deserve to be happy all the time. And I can't stand it when you're sad. So if there's ever something I can do to make you smile, name it. Thanks. I will. It makes me happy to hear you feel that way. Time flies when you're having fun, it seems. I wondered how I was going to fill the day before. Now it's already over. I wish the way back to the Sanctorium would take longer, so we could stay like this. Uh-huh. Did you say something, Hina? No, nothing. Shall we head to the Sanctorium? Definitely tell that Val and Hina would like to spend more time together. wonder if they're feeling the 
time is ticking as they head to the mana tree. Well, I think this is a, probably a great stopping point. We're about 40 minutes in, so in our next one we'll attend the rites of initiation and see what happens then. I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in, and we'll be talking again real soon.